Yo, what's going on, gang? Today we have the Tuesday, May 14th patch notes. These are a day early. Usually we get these on Wednesdays, but today there were a couple things that were super broken uh, they needed to address. We got the Lockwood change to the MK2 resolve an issue causing incompatible attachments. Nothing crazy there. The real problem of today's video was Core 45. So if you didn't know, if you haven't played Warzone lately, if you are on mouse and keyboard, you can set your Core 45's fire to your scroll wheel. And if you have a mouse, which I don't play on a keyboard and mouse, but if you have a mouse similar to this, I have a lock switch right here. And I can press that, and then I'll actually just scroll now so you can see it'll infinitely spin as fast as I want it to. What I'm getting at is, if you set your fire rate on the Core 45 to the scroll wheel and you would scroll, it would shoot faster than most submachine guns. I mean, it would dump... 50 round mags out instantly and the TTK on it was absolutely broken. I mean, you thought the Renetti was insane. The Core 45 was extremely broken. So today they came out with the patch notes, implemented measures to prevent exploits that allow firing faster than intended. Essentially all they did today, they nerfed the lightweight trigger from a uh, 700 round per minute, something like that, 750 round per minute to a 650. All that really did was change the TTK from around 400 to 450, give or take. So the gun really isn't fixed. And I want to like kind of address this as a whole. I know this is something you do with a scroll wheel with a mouse, but the real question comes for people who genuinely run Cronus or Strike Packs, whatever it may be, modded controllers, I don't know. Can they use like jitter mods in a way that a scroll wheel could be used on their mouse. That, I mean, that's a huge question. I know a while back they said that, you know, Cronus has been banned and this, that, and the other, but people still comment on the channel constantly saying, oh, you use a Cronus. So it makes me wonder, did they actually ever change anything with a Cronus? I, I mean, I have no clue how that works with hooking up for COD, whatever, but I wanna know if, you're using like these strike packs if people are still able to exploit this not only on pc but on controller so like i obviously i play on a scuff the only thing i could do exploit wise i switch my bumpers so instead of shooting with triggers i shoot with bumpers i talk about that in my controller setup video but i really want to know if there's a way these people are going to be able to use this core 45 on a scale of uh, a controller like with that with, I guess a jitter mod is what you'd call it back in the day so there's really no telling um it's it's kind of frustrating it's definitely problematic do I think it's gonna like ruin Warzone not at all I mean it's gonna be annoying when you encounter it uh, because of how fast it actually kills but I don't think everyone's gonna be able to use it you know it's just one of those things when you kind of have a uh, PC and uh, console kind of integrated or you know mouse and keyboard integrated with controller you know, you have mouse and keyboard people crying about aim assist, but then you have us, you know, controller players freaking out because these mouse and key players are setting macros to make their guns rapid fire and do whatever it may be. So that was the big thing. So when we read today's patch notes that they implemented measures to prevent the exploits, nothing really changed. Uh, the TTK time to kill changed maybe 50 milliseconds. That's not enough to make a big difference. So this is still very much a problem. I wouldn't be surprised to see another update on this, if not tomorrow and the upcoming week. Um, so we might touch back on that as well. Uh, something else, it says right here, uh, attachments, adjusted pro and cons for multiple optic attachments to reflect the true statistics. Corio Enforcer, the Dragon's Eye Optic, and the KR uh, Marauder 9 Riser Gang. Uh, that's really about it. It's a couple issues with like tracking operators, biometric scanners, stuff like that. Nothing crazy. Uh, this was the bulk right here. Was Core 45. If you are new to the channel, enjoy the content and hit that sub button. Press that like button. I catch you tomorrow for another heater. Let's get it good.